another pretty face I don't want just anyone to hold I don't want my love to go to waste Hey guys, so I have a reason behind getting everything that I got. So this is like a little haul for all of my hamsters because I never get them anything from the store. And I just thought I'd try some of this stuff. And all of my hamsters are, well, my robos are going to be two years and six months old on June 23rd, which is also my birthday. And my Syrian hamster Peach is going to be six months old. And I know that's not necessarily an accomplishment, but I really wanted to do something for the Roboskis before they get too much older. So I'm just kind of buying them some new stuff. So in total, all of this stuff cost me $20.15. And I'm just going to read out the stuff to you as we go along. So the first thing I got from... Um, this is all from PetSmart. The first thing I got was this. It's a hay, like a woven apple, and it's hay because that's what it smells like. Or a Timothy hay or something like that. And it says for dwarf hamsters and hamsters. And there's nothing on the back, really. It's from Super Pet. Um, I'm thinking I'm gonna give this to, um, maybe Abernathy. I'm not too sure. One of the robos. So, the woven apple. And that was... $2. Um, the next thing I have is a Living World Fruit Wood Juice, and I thought you can only buy these in the UK, but apparently I didn't look hard enough because they were right there. And, sorry, it's not focusing. And they said they're, they help cl trim clean teeth, and they use non-toxic colors, and it says it's Perfect for hamsters, mice, gerbil, guinea pigs, and children, and rabbits. I mean, I think it's a little small for rabbits, but either way, they're really, it's really cute. And I'm going to give this one to the dwarfs, one of the dwarfs, as just their own personal little toy. So what happened was I bought one toy for all of the hamsters. I bought them a treat mix, and then I bought them, like, just some kind of, like, toy and treat things. So... These two things are for the dwarves, and that was two forty nine. Now the next thing I have are these caramel crop veggie wedges, and that it really is kind of weird. It's a loofah on the outside, then it has a alfalfa mix on the inside, and I'll read the back in a second. But it's by Carnival Crops, and it says it's. For rabbits, guinea pigs, chinchillas, rats, hamsters, mice, and gerbils. And it's by Critterware. And just kind of says what's up there. Then it has this. Then it has the nutritional value. And it has a lot of fiber, so I'll probably like take these in and out of the cage. So, yeah, just want to try these out. Um, there is an ingredients list. I know there's alfalfa alf, alf there. But I think I'm going to give these to the Robo since there's two, and I think they might enjoy it. But I don't know, none of my hamsters actually enjoy Lufa too much, but I'm going to go ahead and give it a try with the stuff on it. And that was $2.99. The next thing I have are these alfalfa field mini alpha carrots, and I've seen these before, just the larger version, I was like, oh, I really want those, and I found them, and they're just, they're little shaped like little carrots, and there's corn husk on the top, and there's like an alfalfa mix on the bottom, and it says it's fine for all small animals, um, some information about them. And then, once again, like all alfalfa products, has a lot of fiber. And it has... it should have the ingredients, but I'm not sure if it does. Nope. So, I'm wondering if they'll like that. They haven't had alfalfa or corn husks or anything like that, so I'm really kind of excited. And those were $3.99. The next thing I got, um, this is a Critter Toys Barrel Roll by Critterware. And it's just like a little barrel roller with a little ball inside. 
And I've seen some at Petco that were like half this size, and I thought the, that was that, but it's not. I think this one would be a better size for a guinea pig or a rat or something like that. But I got it for my Syrian peach. Um, just about it. And then, yeah, not much else. So I'm interested to give this to her because I think it'd be really fun. She'll enjoy it. Um, that was $2.49. And now the last thing I got them were these mini tart snacks, and this was the only, um, like, treat that I got them because they don't really go too fast in when I give my hamsters as I don't give them treats too much. So it says garnished with blackberries and cranberries and raspberries. So it's a very berry, um, treat. And it looks like it just has a little bit of a crust on the outside and the mix on the inside. And it says it's for hamsters, mice, skinny pigs, rabbit, and other small animals. Um, we have like a feeding tip that I'm not sure about. Um, the ingredients. And yeah, these really aren't the most the most healthy at all. They have a little more protein than I thought they would. Um yeah, I just kind of wanted to try them. So, I only got these because it was their birthday, like, just kind of celebrating. So I was like, hey, maybe I'll get them something a little sweeter. And I was going to get them something like a rice treat, but they didn't really have... Well, they did have it. I just kind of chose, hmm, I'll do something fun. So I thought these would be cute, and there are a lot of a lot in here for my hamsters because they will not go through these fast. So I'll have these stocked up for a little while. And so that was six or four sixty six, and that was kind of the most expensive thing that was in there. So all the stuff I got for my animals.